timestamp. Beginning of Ships of the Line Federation Discovery class starts now. Hello, this is Front Fox giving to you the Ships of the Line series for Star Trek Legacy. Anyways, I have a match set up currently. And this time, um, I'm going to use the Discovery class ships. Um, so far, we're only going to have one respawn. A time limit of 10 minutes, hopefully it won't take that long, since, you know, this will take a little bit longer. Because of the beginning. We're going to be going up against the uh, Romulans this time around. As the fe Federation. Let's see. It's the US is defined, we don't want that. Here it is. We want the Discovery class. Get three of those. And it's a very small ship with only one photon bank and two phaser banks. But it has a significant disadvantage, as you can see, from the um, stats it has. As being a Enterprise era ship, it has exactly no shields. But we could upgrade a couple of things, like the weapon and the hull, to give it, you know, an added punch to whatever we're going to face up against this round. Yeah, the other thing is sensors and engines, and apparently it's a exploring type ship, so we don't want any of those. So, um, engines can be useful at times when you have the extra credits too, but the sensors, um, I typically don't get those. Though they do help with other um, things. This is the Discovery class, for some odd reason it just did a flip. Alright, we're up against these Romulan hunters. They're actually pretty big ships, so um hopefully I'll be able to have them. Alright, phase cannons. And there goes my one torpedoes. I missed. The Praetor demands your destruction. Captain, enemy shields are down. Of course, the ship doesn't have anything on its aft end, so it's going to prove to be a significant disadvantage. Yeah, the shields on this thing don't really last that long, but unfortunately, um, the hull is pretty tough. I'd say probably on par with uh, some of the other classes. There goes one of my nacelles, even though I still have one attached to my ship. It's a bug. Yeah, so far we only see one. And he disabled my engines. There we go. Once again, he's behind me. Enemy vessel detected. Engaging target. Engaging target. Major's lock. Ah, oh, he just took out my weapons. Great. Ah, oh, here comes the second ship. That's what I needed. We're gonna switch ships here now. Significant damage to enemy sensors. This one's about dead. There we go. So far, so good. I still have three of my ships, and there goes one of theirs. Target shields down. As you can see, I'm trying to not to let it get behind me. So I'm. Ah, uh, there goes. Here comes the third one. There is no escape for you. Fortunately for me, it seems I'm a little bit more maneuverable at the moment. So. Niagara to 
It's like one of my ships is gonna go under. And there it goes. Awesome. A very generic response. Captain, sensors report enemy vessel. Here's the standing by. response ship. There's only one response, so. Discovery to fleet. We have arrived at our destination. Taking Lasers ready, There is no escape for you. Well, that one is sparling out. The phase cannons on these things are actually very similar to the um, NX class, and I really like these phase cannons. Problem is, I just don't like the ship. Unfortunately, these Romulans, Battle Hawks, whatever, they have multiple torpedo launchers, which in which I only have one, and they're, it misses. And another one of my ships is gonna go under. Losing all of its subsystems. There it is, and there it goes. Great. I guess my weapons are damaged because it's taking a while to charge back up. And I lost weapons. Figures. Oh yeah, now he says it. This one still has weapons up. There is no escape for you. Uh, there goes the other ship spiraling out that managed to restabilize itself. Not sure it's gonna last very long. And I lost both weapons and engines. And this ship just lost its engines. Destroy the other ship. Unfortunately, this one is on my blind spot. Ah, here it comes. And there goes that. I need a power to uh, try to destroy this one. It's an uphill battle though, I don't think we can make it. That's shields and armor, and I basically am half dead. And there goes my engines again. And now it's in my blind spot. Engines are back online, Captain. Completely helpless ones behind me. Yes, my slow turning rate. Stand against us. You invite your doom. Come on. Our sensor systems are offline, Captain. Yeah, I'm not gonna win this. Full power to weapons. Fool! You are clearly outmatched. It's taking forever for my weapons to recharge. And there goes my last ship as it spirals out towards the planet. Great. It's a small ship, weak ship, and um. I don't really like it that much, and probably none of you are ever going to use this ship. The 1000 um, credits could be better used saving up for something like an X class. And out of 1 through 10, 10 being the highest, the best, I guess this one a 1.5. And that's all for this segment. Um, next one.
don't know what it's going to be, but you'll find out soon enough. Later.